Hello and good afternoon to you. My name is Neil and I'm going to give you a vis visual uh, presentation of this uh, Volkswagen Passat uh, 1.9 TDI 130 brake horsepower sport estate car. Just come in, nicely prepared and ready to go. This is a 2005 car, 54 edge, 2005, one owner, direct from Lease Plan, if I remember rightly, or Master Lease, one of the major fleet companies. You'll see that when we come to the history section. So um, what we're going to do, we're going to run around really and tell you all the little bits that you need to know and uh, that way you'll be uh, f hopefully safe in the knowledge that what you're coming to look at is basically what you're after. So then the Sport Estate um, is a very good class leading uh, estate car. Uh, I dealt with Passats for many years, in fact there's another one there that we've just sold. Uh, this is the 130, the Sport is the one to have really. So if you're after a Sport, do consider this. It's done 104,000 miles and a bit but that really doesn't make any difference the way to the car drives it drives absolutely brilliantly and it has the advantage that it is an 05 plate as well so it's relatively new uh, there is a long MOT with the car as well January you'll see that again in the history section there will be some nice fresh number plates fitted as well uh, just to tidy the car up right then let's run around it then so metallic dolphin grey it is the facelifted version it does have the indicators in the mirrors and also the new type wiper blades it's got a uh, reactor light rear view mirror I think there's rain sensors on it as well and uh, the paintwork's in good order there is just a, a few minor marks nothing really to worry about um, this one's got obviously the tinted glass as well and uh, I've driven this test driven it for 15 miles and it drives very well indeed I can't fault the drive the clutch is good there is a minor scratch just to this rear quarter just there very small scratch about uh, four inches three inches long and a one minor dimple dent just there very small again right uh, that side basically is covered then the tailgate area is really tidy rear wash wiper high level brake light and uh, all that works fine it's got the baggage cover present and correct there is two 12 volt power supplies in the back there as well and this load area is very tidy it hasn't been molested it is in very good order okay the seats fold down to reveal a, a nice load uh, loading bay the bottoms come up and the seats fold down on top right let's move around to this side then basically this side is uh, very tidy as well uh, there is a minor uh, bit of body damage just this rear wheel arch it's not really broken the paint it's just uh, had an altercation with a, a bit of a wooden post I would have thought pushed it in slightly it's very small you can hardly notice it but again I'd like to inform you of these things before you come um, yeah all that sounds good no scratches or marks in fact it's very clean and tidy really for the miles that it's done and uh, the leading edge of the bonnet showing a few minor stone chips as you'd expect but nothing much I'd say probably a lot less than you'd expect the uh, glass has got one small stone chip uh, they're about the size of a uh, well it's about three millimeters in diameter it's very small I don't think it's an MOT failure it probably passed its MOT with that on there anyway the uh, wheels well there's Michelin tires on this one here so a quick look the pads are loads of meat to go in the pads Michelin tire he's about uh, about 30 percent worn and the alloy is showing some signs of scuffing again Michelin tire he's bit newer again about 20 percent worn and again a, a little bit of uh, scuffing to that alloy as well unfortunately these alloys do get scuffed they protrude out and I've yet to know one that's uh, even done 20k without some minor marks on it uh, again a good tire Michelin tire all branded tires Michelin tire again uh, actually he's a bit uh, lower that one I reckon he's about 20 percent 30 percent to go so none of them are in desperate need of uh, replacing and I think a uh, good two or three are uh, plenty of um, many miles to go especially with Michelin's as well okay right then um, roof bars that's about the exterior covered and uh, let's progress to the interior all right then welcome to the uh, interior section door card on the back here in good order nice gray cloth interior checkered cloth eight speaker hi-fi electric windows all round this one's got the three inertia reel safety belts so that you can fit three people in comfort and the seats are in the back here are in nice tidy order good condition uh, so are the carpets the ashtray works so does the cigar lighter and there's pockets in the back of the seats there as well all the internal courtesy lights are working fine and plenty of airbags unfortunately there's a couple of minor marks one to the 
Um, uh, roof lining. And another one there. That's about it, really. Two small marks for the roof lining. These estate cars do tend to get used as family vehicles and can get to a bit of a bashing with bikes and things that get put in them. That's, but that's a really tidy back uh, seat there, back seat area. Up to the front here, so there's um, electrically heated and operated rear view mirrors, as you can see there. Four electric windows, and the door card's in good, tidy order. The driver's seat, while it's showing very, hardly any signs of wear, it's got the lumbar support as well, and the uh, carpet area is in very tidy order with pedal rubbers all looking virtually brand new. Let's jump in the car a second. All right, the radio works fine. Airbags, well, we've got two, four, six, eight, eight airbags, ABS brakes, traction control, center armrest, removable center armrest, little CD storage, cup holders, six speed box, lovely for fuel consumption, easily attain 50 mpg from these, six disc CD, radio, cassette and uh, this one's got the cruise control so an option there of cruise control and a reactor light rear view mirror i don't think they all have that reactor light rear view mirror right let's fire up she's done 104,075 miles all the lights go out as they should everything works perfectly there and the steering wheel is a leather type and in very nice clean tidy order all the books are present and correct as you'll see in the video section for the history glove box all working fine it does have the uh, uh, airbag on off switch if you have a family and you need to disarm the airbag and there are courtesy lights in the mirrors etc okay this one has the uh, climate control air conditioning um, it has a sensor and it tells and uh, you can tell it basically to keep the cockpit at the uh, temperature that you want and all digitalized for air conditioning so climate air con um, there are two keys two remote keys which is rather nice to have um, Beware, most of these fleet cars don't come with spare keys, so you have to get another key cut. This one's had the cam belt change, as you'll be aware of. Let's just uh, open the bonnet up. So she's all running nicely. Coolant bottles clean and tidy, screen washer all topped up. Okay, long life servicing interval sticker on the front there. Special oils are used for these PD engines, you must make sure you use them. Okay, the uh, passenger side is um, just as tidy as the driver side really, the seats showing nowhere, airbags in the front seats obviously. Okay, again, good door card and uh, passenger side rear as well, all in tidy, good order. That interior is a nice place to be, it's certainly a clean tidy place and uh, I think you could probably view about five or six and be hard pressed to find one as tidy inside as that okay lovely right well thanks very much for watching this video clip i hope it's been of some use to you uh, now if you are interested this car is available we do offer part exchange but not on everything though but we do consider it the car can be taxed ready to take away the post office is only 10 minutes up the road if you come during working hours office hours we can tax it for you now these are cheap road fund license i think they're only 145 pounds for a year 79 pounds for six months okay that is a nice tidy car the only slight negative is the wheels are lightly curbed and the and that's about it really i can't think there's anything else that would uh, as a used car buyer would really put you off on that no nope, it's very tidy it's a good color as well and a dark interior nice and forgiving for family use okay telephone numbers at the end give me a call if you're keen on that one thank you bye bye